Okay then. Let's go. Level three, yay! Oh, this guy won't follow me, but it's okay. Whoa, where did you come from? No, you killed my. Ah. Oh God. Kids got a squirt lure at the ready in case things turn sour. Oh, not these things again. I hate these things. I run into them way too easily. Wah! Well, that was easy. Jared is playing gone haywire. Windbags gummed up the works. Kid ain't afraid of getting burned. Yeah, I am. Did you see that I'm standing all the way back here? Yes, they trapped oh, no. the kid in the middle of the fort's parade grounds. But. Then they bring out Glutus and Glandon and all their scumbag uncles. Oh God! Nope, 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 nope. So they much got nope. something to gain, and only their sorry hides to lose. So much nope in this. The uncles go out with a whimper. Do 
my do my work for me. Kid takes down Glutus. Well, maybe it was Glandon. The windbags finally get the message. Yay! Isn't so bad, right? Oh, well, let's go and get that. Marshall's badge. Kid used to dream of getting a Marshall's badge, but not like this. I still wonder what would happen if I didn't fall off um, on the first uh, map. Remember how I fall off and thought everything was over, but then I landed in Bastion? Yeah. Wonder what would happen if I never fell, fell off. The Skyway is a welcome sight after all that. Yeah, it is. So let's return to the Bastion. And now ain't nothing left for nobody down at Cinderbrook Fort. Kid shows up just as Ulf's telling me about his own journey to the city. Ooh, I want to hear. Wait, you guys speak from, like, this far apart? Okay. Hello? The marshals seem like good men, he says. They treated him with dignity. Zolf brought his antique smoking pipe all the way from the terminals. Seems the only thing the Calamity saved for Zolf was his smoking pipe. So what is it? Poor kid collapses after just one drag. Oh god. Ah. Uh... The past. Only good thing ever come out of the past is history. So... What is this? I didn't... Oh god, is this like an arena or something? Oh god, it's not... Haha! <laughs> I'm almost dead already. Great. The past catches up with the kid. Hardly had a moment's rest since all this started. I get knocked off. Fair to say he's led a hard life. Supposing what he says in his sleep ain't no lie. And I need a lot of black tonics, this one. Oh god. He never knew his old man, but he had his mama to take care of. Frail thing with pure white hair like his.
having his mama's hair to the kid no favors while he was growing up, but he learned to hold his own out there. Lovely bow. School ain't working out, so the kid signs up for a turn on the rippling walls. Make his mama some money. What I need now is health. I'm gonna die if I don't get health soon. Thanks to folks like the kid, the walls kept Ceylandia safe from whatever's out there. The elements, the aura, you name it. Ah. Once a kid done his time, he hurried on home. Turns oh, out his mama's no. time was done too. Thank God. <gasps> no, I'm gonna die at this one. The city had nothing for him. The money he'd been sending home was nowhere to be found, either. So where's... Is this like the kid's past or something? Oh dear. Ah! Did I fall off? I fall off. Oh god, <laughs> not good. Oh god, that is not a, the way to go. <laughs> nope, I'm gonna die right here, right now. So what the kid do? Why it went right on back to the walls for another five years. In the history of Ceylandia, Nobody's ever volunteered for a second shift on the walls. I'm so gonna die. I am so gonna die. There, a kid learned to fend for himself, learn to build, learn to break. How am I still alive? Must kill these before they spawn. Time the kid earned good standing with the marshals. They trusted him to scout out farther than anybody. I have nothing.
Oh, no, no, no. <gasps> one night, on one of his expeditions, the ground beneath him shuddered, cracked, and split apart. <gasps> God, no, 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 no. He saw nothing where the world used to be. The calamity happened just like that. Oh. What was I saying? Anyway. Two chances. Okay. Wow, then that All the kid had to work long. with was his hammer and the clothes on his back. I heard it. Something dropped. Health tonic. Okay, I got it. I wasted a health tonic there. I still thought I have, like, really. Oh! Through twisted streets, he ran with nothing but the city crest and an old stranger's voice to guide him. Ah! Uh... Oh god, I need a squirt. really no fountains around here. No. Well, he finally arrived at Ceylandia's vaunted safe haven. He and no one else. What I need? Ah, uh, black tonic. Oh god. Not good. I really need a squirt to tank for me. Mm, no, I'm dead. Wait, where was I? Oh wait, one more chance. Well, he's that killed everything. But then, all he got was more thankless work from a man who ain't even asked his name. True reflection. Okay.
Sure, I may be the one who dreamt up the walls and the bastion, but the kid made them real. Not me. Okay. Oh! What is that? Oh no. Panic. Panic. Is that thing? I don't want to get it near it. <gasps> Thank I'd like you. to say I'll never forget him or what he's doing, what he's done. I surely would. Oh God! I only hear half of that story that the guy told because I was so busy trying to stay alive. But ah, oh, wow. I'm a last chance, really? No, I'm not touching you again. I'm gonna talk with this guy. Even since the Ura surrendered to us, the marshals kept a wary eye on him. Okay. Okay, after that intense fight, I think it's time to pause the video. And when we get back, I'll put down the... Uh, core in the monument and we'll see what we can build for the bastion so till next time bye